I was acting mad, guys. I was acting so mad yesterday. Thank you so much. Wow. I got, I got a really mean comment. There was actually a bit of drama. You guys dragged me for the 10 minute vlog. So I'm just on a route to Clapham. I'm going to meet my friend Dwayne. I quickly got ready. Like I'm gonna be, I'm gonna try to be a really good vlogger this week because I know a lot of you guys were dragging me in the comments for it being 10 minutes, but hopefully this week it'll be a lot more longer. So yeah. Oh, we just got two. What's the park called, Dwayne? Clapham. Say hey. What's going on or whatever? We're in Clapham, living our best lives. Guys, I've never been to Clapham Park before. It's actually like, a man, it's so hot. Honestly, me and Dwayne are like mad. Oh, why is it zoomed in? It's on hot you be sitting on a man's hunting on a fine wine. Her. <laughs> Don't kill me. Just got home. It's like two o'clock in the morning. Had the best time ever out. Oh, I really want to go out tomorrow, but I'm actually working. I'm, I'm playing too hard. So if I get my work done tomorrow, I'm going to go. But my hay fever allergies are killing me. It's 2 a.m., guys. I'm going to go to bed and I'm going to check if you guys tomorrow. I've got so much work to do. Hey, um, I'm literally just getting ready because I've got a facial today and you guys were really dragging me last night for the 10 minute vlog. And I've, I've actually known just by looking at it that like short vlogs don't do well. Um, yesterday was so crazy. Like, I went to this place called Clap and Common. In, oh my god, it's so hot. It's actually boiling. It's at 28 degrees today. Um, I've got a facial. But yeah, yesterday was crazy. I went to this little clap of column, so I'm, I'm getting really distracted. Let me try this moisturizer actually. I've never really used it. I was just mad, guys. I was acting like I'm not a damn fool. Okay, Ole. Oh, what's this called? This is the Ola Hemmingson Cold Plunge Pore Remedy Moisturizer. That's good for oily skin, but it feels so nice on the skin. I'm not wearing makeup obviously because I'm sorry, it's my um allergies. Because I'm having a facial, there's no need to. Oh my god, is you put any vitamin C on? It's fine. Oh, I need my eyebrows doing. I wonder if I can get my eyebrows done anywhere in Selfridges and Harrods. I'm about to see there's a walk-in appointment because I need my eyebrows doing. Like badly. Um I'm just gonna do like really basic skincare. I'm gonna use this ultraviolet um, SPF, it's really, really good. I got this scent like, maybe about last week and it's really, it's got SPF 50. That's all I've been wearing recently, SPF 50, because, you know, there's been these like myths about, you know, should you really wear SPF 50? Should you wear, no, should you really wear, wear SPF 30? And then I can't put loads on. I'm wearing shades anyway. But yeah, I'm gonna take you, ooh, look at this glow, babes. I actually feel really rough today. If, I was actually That's mad, guys. <laughs> I was actually so mad yesterday. Like, what is wrong with me? But um, I'm gonna pop into a store to see if they have any sandals. I've wanted them for a while. If it's not hard, it's no biggie. I'll take you, I might even, I probably won't be even be allowed to record in there, but it's fine. We can go along together. So, hey guys, I'm literally just got out of my speech station and I'm literally gonna go and look in the store now. Oh my God, it's so freaking hot. Look at my vest. Oh, I look like a whore. Look how hot it is. It's actually mad. Facial is all done, guys. Facial is looking so glowy. Thanks, this lovely lady right here. Thank you so much. Wow. Okay, so we're just around North Greenwich here, and everyone comes here to get the North Kick Up. Guys, when I say these have been here for so long, like it's actually flipping mad. So I'm literally just about to get the flipping boat home. I've never got it before. But look at that, how crazy it is. I just don't get why people can't mind their business. Okay, let's see if we can have success getting this boat home. Oh my god, I'm so tired. Decided to take the boat home. Okay, so I'm literally just on the Uber boat home, guys. This is crazy. Like, I can't really say what's going on. You are now entering the Uber boat home. 
actually are insane to do that. I'm home. It was so cute getting an Uber boat back home. I was saying, I can't breathe. I literally just chugged down a, like a bag full of water because I was so thirsty. Skin looks really nice. Her facial is really, really good. I haven't been for a facial for so long. Like, I'm literally just sitting down watching Wendy Williams. Like, oh my God. I'm actually stuffed. I'm literally just trying to figure out my schedule for this week. It's going to be a sip and slay on Friday. Also, I'm going to try and fit in another live, but we have to see. Cause I've got so much work to do and so much projects that are going on. But I hope everyone is okay anyway. I'm literally yeah, catching up with Wendy Williams. and about Meghan Markle's father's talking. I can add that to sip and slay, actually. I need to write down the topics for what I'm going to do on Friday. I guess today was really, really cute. Actually, oh my God, I didn't show you what I got from Hermes. I'll probably show you tomorrow because I actually want to show you. Basically... The, uh, what I got, oh, I can't even explain. I got them in a, I got the, uh, so, so, the, basically shoes. I got them in a tan and they ran, ran me and basically said they had them in the black. So uh, you'll probably see them before if I do exchange them anyway. So you guys can give me an um, opinion on what color you think will suit me best. But I'll show you tomorrow because now it's actually quite dark as you guys can see outside. And yeah, I'm going to like lock off. I need to clean my place. It's such oh, it's also, my place is always a mess, guys. I'm receiving so much makeup at the moment. It's actually giving me a headache. I might do some charity bags again. I feel like I'm I really want to give back to a pride charity this month. I feel really blocked up, but I'll check in you guys later. Okay. Morning. Um, I'm just up. Um, I literally just filmed a little TikTok of my morning actually. I thought let me just try and do one because I love seeing these kind of TikToks. Let me see if I can get it up for you. Um oh shit, I don't think I can play it with the sound now. I feel like I definitely got copyrighted, so I'm not even sure how I'm going to show you. Actually, no, I can turn down the sound. Um, it's literally 9.49, and I've got gym at 12, so, so that's me waking up, getting ready, doing my bed, and putting the, you know, it's like a cute little mini moment. Let's see? That's how cute it is, so I thought I'd do something like that. Let's be honest. Sometimes it's so long doing shit. But anyway, I'm actually going, what am I doing today? I've got gym. And then today's kind of like not my busiest day. Like, oh, should I take my hay fever tablet? Um, I'm getting some Botox done today. I actually need to even update you. I was meant to do a video on like fillers and everything because everyone just keeps asking. And like, I was just like, I'm just gonna do a video speaking about it, but I might do it as an extra upload this week, if not next. Just speaking about treatments and stuff because a lot of you guys always ask. Botox was honestly amazing. Like, I can't even lie. Like, I think it's one of those treatments where obviously you don't see something straight away. It takes a few weeks to kick in. But when it's kicking in, the Botox in is Botox in period. How cute is this cup I showed you in before my vlog? Obviously, I've been receiving so much nasty comments on my YouTube recently. Like, I know um, one of my videos got pushed to be on the pride list. And I knew I was going to get comments from that, which they did warn me about. But recently, people have just been so horrible on my YouTube channel. Like, I got I got a really mean comment a few days ago, which was just so mean. And it's not the same, it's not the same person. I'm not sure why I would block them, but they disappeared out of nowhere again. So I'm just like, oh, whatever. Yeah, I need to get ready. My hay fever is just so bad at the moment. I can't get over it. So have a good morning, guys. Well, it'll be Sunday while you're watching it. So I hope you're having a good Sunday. <laughs> to the gym. I'm actually doing legs today with Sebastian. Oh god, I just went on the bike there, one of those bikes. I'm so... Uh, you know you're not playing the gym, but... Go, I get this body snatched! Damn, Guys, I literally just finished my gym session. I'm literally in... Night speech at the moment is so cute, let me show you. So there's Harrods over there. Like you guys, well Harrods is like one of the most known. So I'm sure it's Harrods and Monopoly, I'm not even sure. But it's such a beautiful day. I've actually got a, a lot of time to kill. The only thing about this area is that there's so much pickpocketers and so much people that are like, because they're rich around here, so they have to be so careful, it's a bit mad. So I'm gonna see if I can find a table around to eat somewhere. And then I feel I'm gonna go and try and get like a new concealer because the one I love, that always set in Harrods, so. Okay, so literally just stopped over to eat. I'm in cafe. I'm, not, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna tell you where I am because the service is so freaking bad, honestly. I literally have a sparkling water and an orange juice. And I have, oh my God, I don't have a lot of time. I've got like 40 minutes into my go But thankfully it's only around the corner. But when I say the service here is actually mad. Like, imagine when I sat down, this guy was just like, wait, I'm like, Where's the please, but it's fine. But I'm putting my food, it was a lamb shank and period. 
this is what I got. I got the lamb shank. I'm gonna let you guys know if it's nice because the last time I had it, it was very, very plain. <laughs> but it will do because I'm bulking. So I'm literally in Canary Wharf. Look how beautiful and peaceful this is. So nice. It's like if I go for my eyebrow appointment, this is like, I think this is the docks, but so pretty. Okay, I'm literally just heading to get my eyebrows done. I don't think I'm gonna be able to record it because you know the camera app plus stretching. So it's just gonna get those done because I'm gonna get a dye on them. So I'll check you guys after I'm going to Blink Bro. Hey guys, um, I'm just back home. I know, why did I say hey guys when you got, you know. Um, I didn't get my eyebrows done, as you can see. Um, there was actually a bit of drama. Um, I don't want to bash the company because they're so nice. I just think it was the individual. So when I walked into the shop, the whole vibe was just off. There was two women in there. They were doing another girl, but it, it seemed like all the women all knew each other. Then when I walked in, she was like, have you got an appointment? Sis, Sis, are you not looking at the diary because it's 4.30? Should you not be checking every hour, hour and a half to see what appointment there is? And then I was like, yeah, 4.30. She, and she looks, she looks, you know what someone looks at like the computer like? I know you ain't got an appointment, bitch. I you have to end it now, like really. Child, do, do I'm getting angry? Cause listen, I really wanted to go off on her. I really wanted to, but anyway, um, she must have been like, oh, okay. She was like, what's the name? I went Gary Thompson. And she was just like, oh, I don't do men's brows. Oh, I, I can't do men's brows. I can't, she was stuttering. I was like, sweetheart, what's wrong? Because you, you, you well, what in the remix is happening? Cause it's, I was, just, I was just very confused because I've seen this one before. Since you've done my eyebrows before, why are you being extra? Anyway, I was so annoyed. So I was like, uh, so what's happening with the appointment? Then she was just like, oh, I really can't do boys' brows or men's brows. You need someone You need someone else. And I was like, but I've been waiting at Aaron Kinnear Wharf. Like, what's happening here? Well, she was like, the get woman over there. She's busy or till we close. So first of all, you're not even being accommodating. You're not even saying, you know what, come back tomorrow. Like someone else can help you with me, yeah. When I used to work in retail, whatever, and, and if something wasn't in or something couldn't be done, come back in tomorrow. Let me see who else can do it. Let me see who, who I can get from somewhere else. Let me see if there's another appointment like in, in a nearer area, but sis, was, sis wasn't here for it. So I left the store and I was so pissed off, yeah, that I actually messaged the brand, the um, company, and was just like, you know what? This is what happened here and there. I feel a bit discriminated and she's moving mad. She's moving mad. First of all, you know what? They replied and said that it was because of religious reasons that she couldn't do my eyebrows. Fair enough. But when I say this woman was rude, she was, she was so, so rude. rude. Like, you know, when you walk into a store and someone's like looking at you like, why are you even in here? Sweetheart, this is a public business. I haven't walked into you into a damn, um, a damn sleepover with you and your girls. Oh, anyway, I'm, I'm over it. I'm going to get my eyebrows done somewhere else. It's kind of annoying because that branch I go to there is my local one. Like it's quite, it's near to where like, I kind of like go in and out of London. So it's just like, if I see her again, it's gonna be so awkward because I'm gonna be like, mm. I should have found out what her name was really because I don't want to even book him with her. So annoying though, it's just so annoying, but it's just one of those things guys. It's just how it is. Like, it's just, I just felt like discriminate. I just felt discriminated. I've never had that before. Like I said, I had to say to her, what's the difference though? Like women and men, I could have, it's like, but I could understand why, but she didn't say, at the time what it why it was if she told me back then i can't do it because you know religious reasons would be like oh my god no problem i totally get it but sis you were doing a to b to c to d and the x like the math weren't math <laughs> the math weren't math and poo let's go back from the gym worst day ever. not worst day i actually had a really good workout oh this unit is itching me so my train on the way to the gym got cancelled a woman went into labor <laughs> So, no, it was, there was just too much bad things happening this morning. I was a bit scared, but I've got to go now. I'm doing I'm doing this my friend's radio station slash, is it a podcast? I think it's a radio station. I've already got a limited time to do makeup on guys. When I say it's so hot outside, like, look at me, I'm sweating. Oh, this is pleasure. Oh, let me wash my hands. Yeah, so anyway, it's so hot today. Um, and this is a place called, what's it? It's called, what is it called? Egg Run, near my gym. Bitch. Let me show you this. Oh, look at these tacos. Like an egg taco, so flipping good. Oh my God, this is so messy though. Okay. Oh. So egg. Mm. Bangum, period. So tight guys. It's so hot outside. Oh. I have to come back home for a Zoom. So annoying. 
I'll do them tomorrow. I've got so much work to do though. I haven't got a YouTube video for tonight. <sighs> I'm such a whore. Oh my god. Did no one want to type? Oh, I look mad. Girl, anyway, I feel like I'm, I'm so shocked. My makeup looks a mess. Everyone's rude. Everyone in that building is rude. But anyway, it was such a good time filming for Mark's radio show. I've never felt so drained. When, it, when you have to speak and think about questions, it's so draining, but obviously in a good way, but like, I'm just so tired, man. Got so much work to do on the, uh, why did I choose to wear leather pants? I am bacon. <laughs> okay, so we have a Zoom. I have a Zoom in a moment. I have to open a box because if I don't open a box, I have, look, this is the drink and this is a uh, passion de, de Clary. And my friend Adiola doing a collaboration with Kate Somerville. She's got a glow edit. Congratulations to her. Wow. That is crazy. I actually just woke up from a nap. So I did my Zoom. I didn't even show you guys. My friend Adiola did a collaboration for a glow edit with Kate Somerville. So if you guys haven't tried this SPF, it's so good. I think I bought it to Mykonos, Dubai, somewhere. And it's called Uncomplicated SPF. She did a goat milk moisturizer. So there's some things I haven't tried in here and look how stunning she looks right here. She looks so gorgeous. So she had a cocktail in there, which I'm not really drinking at the moment, but I am, but I'm not, but I am, but I'm not. So um, I think it was that, the heat, my hay fever tablets, they just knocked me out. So um, I was literally doing a shopping list of some things what to get. Guys, outside, why is the rain? I was wondering what that package was. So crazy. Like, I think I've had a sleep with like makeup on, which is so bad. That's how you know my ass. What's going on guys? I legit haven't vlogged all day today. I've literally been filming this Pride campaign for Klana. So you follow me on Instagram, it should go up. I literally took off my makeup. Um, when the Pat McGrath, the video for this should have been up already. This should be the Pat McGrath blusher look. I'm so freaking tired. Like if I show you the pictures and stuff, I have to literally get on this counter to make everything work because my living room is quite a weird, like I feel like there's not enough spotlights. Like they're all very, I wish there was more light because oh, it's just so annoying. My place, look at all of these PR packages right here. That's, that's like PR package rubbish, PR package rubbish, PR package rubbish. Like it's actually a madness how much packages I've been receiving recently, but I'm doing loads of giveaways. This only feels kind of, you. Oh. UK people like if you're at a makeup artist or something let me know and um I can meet people places and give you makeup obviously if, I'm gonna do charity bags well like insane ones because I want to give to a charity as well just because I've got too much makeup guys and it's a bit overwhelming at the moment like even for me so I'm like <sighs> too much makeup like everywhere I look makeup everywhere I look makeup everywhere I open makeup everywhere it's too much okay so um, I'm gonna take up this lip and it, this lip, this lip is lipping now, okay. And then my food shall be ready soon. Let me show you what I'm eating. I be eating, I be geeking, break a silent into pieces. What I'm eating, oh, I'm gonna smells. I'm not get food poisoning, <laughs> I'm just joking. I can't remember, I defrosted that yesterday so it should be okay. I always get scared of getting food poisoning. Isn't a body body egg? <laughs> Isn't the body bodying? <laughs> Chat, guys. Oh my gosh, I'll show you what I bought. I'm not sure where I'm going, but I'm, I'm gonna be going somewhere this summer and wearing this, like, look at the underwear I bought. Like, so obviously it's not see-through when you put it on, but it's from this brand called Average Citizen. And I've seen a few guys wear this and I'm like, you know what, life is short. If I wanna wear, if I wanna, if I wanna give you body on the beach and be, you know. That's what it looks like. Oh, I don't want to turn around. So the body is body eating. Okay, okay. Oh, child, the I love everything about this. Like, obviously, I couldn't show you all of it because obviously this is nuts. This is not that kind of thing, okay? So I'm going to eat. Take this lip off because i got to eat. And I'll check you guys tomorrow. Because if it's late tomorrow, we're excited. We're going to eat those if it's late for ages. I'm heading out to meet Natasha. Here's my spare mask. I'm going to be late. Oh, outfit, Prada's, Lola looks jacket, so cute. Guys, get into this outfit. 
so cute. We just got home. It's oh, she's taking my unit off. I was actually gonna do a episode tonight, but I might have to do one tomorrow now because I want to upload. Hold on. Hey Siri, what time is it? It's twenty forty-three. Mm, it's too late to upload my YouTube video now because I wanted to upload a YouTube video which was announcing my slip and slay. So probably I'm gonna just do one tomorrow because it just makes a lot of sense because I'm not doing anything on Sunday. So you guys would have watched that by then, but I think I'm gonna end the vlog here, guys. I think it's been more of an eventful week. You guys dragged me for the 10 minute vlog that I flipping done last week, which I know was a bit mad because no one really wants to watch anything for 10 minutes. 10 minutes is a bit short, at least 15. So I'm really sorry about that, but I hope this day has been eventful. I had such a good time with Natasha. I hardly vlogged anything because I feel like when, we, well, sometimes, when you, sometimes you just wanna enjoy the moment, sometimes vlogging, is obviously amazing but sometimes you just want to sit down and just chill get into this top though I spent some I do I actually really love this top yeah so I'm gonna end the vlog here hope you guys have a really good weekend well you've had a good weekend and I shall see you next Sunday for the vlog I shall see you on Sun Wednesday Wednesday yes for a really cute review just finished shipping today I was just sitting in my vlog yet and I was like oh my god I didn't even show them what I got from MS I know I told you guys um I got some footwear I got some sandals, let me show you them. So this is a box that comes in. This is my, no, I've shot from Hermes before, but this is like my first kind of like footwear purchase from Hermes. I feel like Hermes is one of those brands where you already know about the Birkins and normally looks at the footwear. I think for girls, the footwear is quite nice. I've actually got um, Hermes, I've had that bracelet for years, like a good like eight years. Like it's such a good investment. Um, So I've got these um sandals. I actually got them in black and brown, but I think I'm actually gonna keep the brown and return the black because I originally went in for black. They don't they have them in the soda everywhere. Look how that's packaged. They actually have the brown in stock and um, I want these for ages. Just they're just like a nice sandal that you can have for years and years. And they're so minimal but statement, but so cute. And I have so many sandals, like I've got my Kenzo ones, Yeezys, and I've always wanted some of these, but the men's ones just I just didn't like the old style. I like them on women but not me, so let's do unboxing together. I actually haven't even looked at these since I bought them. Like, I've just been so freaking busy. Let me put this bit down for you. So, box like that, it's not orange box. Wow, the boxes are really nice. So these are the ones I got. So these are called the Cypher sandals. Um, so these are a bit more of, they've got a bit more of a platform and I've got these on, so it kind of really secures the foot. Um, they do these in black, so let me guys know what you think of these ones. You think I should got these in the black? Um, I really like these ones because they're a bit nude as well. They're not brown, they're a bit more of like a charcoal brown. So I'm gonna try them on now, so I can show you guys. Give me a sec, my place is such a mess. Okay, so I literally, oh, I'm gonna show you how I mess up. I put through on these jeans. These are from Topshop, they're really old. I was gonna throw them away, but they're actually in my charity um, clothes bag. But I thought, let me just throw these on. Can we put these on? This is what they look like. I'm not sure if you can see the light too much. Like that. I probably would wear my Issy pants. Like I feel like this. I don't really wear jeans, but these were the kind of closest things. Black pants. I think they're so nice. My toes need cutting. But what, what do you guys think? Like they're just so comfortable and just so. I just think they're so chic as well. Like timeless. Um, I'll show you guys the black. I'm gonna show you guys the black ones so you guys can see it. So here are the black ones. Um, again, you guys can help me choose because I like the black, but my friend likes the brown. Oh, can we, can we look, look at the black? I don't like the black with this outfit. Just, just FYI, I don't really wear. So that's the black here. You guys see, that's the black. Do you jeans look the most flattering? The black don't really pop, do they? But I guess you could wear the black of anything. Let me know in the comments down below, but that is the end of this is different today, the vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed it and it wasn't 10 minutes this um, week. But yeah, I'll just see you guys on Wednesday. I love you guys so much. And yeah, I hope you guys have a really beautiful weekend.